Simply learn. Your pace, your place. Topic 10. CISSP Operation Security. Introduction. Hello and welcome to Lesson 10 of the CISSP Certification Course by Simply Learn. This lesson is about Operations Security. Operations Security is one of the 10 domains of the Common Body of Knowledge, CBK, for the CISSP Certification Exam. Security Operations domain is used to identify critical information and the execution of selected measures that eliminate or reduce adversary exploitation of critical information. It includes the definition of the controls over hardware, media and the operators with access privileges to any of these resources. Auditing and monitoring are the mechanisms, tools and facilities that permit the identification of security events and subsequent actions to identify the key elements and report the pertinent information to the appropriate individual, group or process. Objectives According to the ICS 2 Candidate Information Bulletin, a CISSP candidate is expected to know the resources that must be protected, the privileges that must be restricted, the control mechanisms available, the potential for abuse of access, the appropriate controls, and the principles of good practice. Agenda. Our agenda for this domain is as follows. We start with the basic concepts of operations security. This will then be followed by the topics maintaining operational resilient, maintaining resilient systems, protecting valuable assets, controlling system accounts. Finally, we'll discuss how to effectively manage security services and key operational processes and procedures. Operations Security Concepts Till now we have seen that all the other domains define some of the basic concepts and tenets of control and a good practice in information and business security. This domain takes those concepts and describes how they are put into practice in an organization. Operations Security Concepts The term Operations Security refers to the act of understanding the threats to and vulnerabilities of computer operations in order to routinely support operational activities that enable computer systems to function correctly. The term also refers to the implementation of security controls for normal transaction processing, system administration tasks and critical 